Hey guys, how's it going? Just wanted to make a quick video on how to manually shift the early C4 transmission, which happens to be the green dot transmission, as they call it, due to this green dot. Um, this transmission was designed back in the 60s. It's a three-speed transmission. And uh, yeah, a lot of people believe that this dot right here, the small dot, is a drive position but that's actually for uh snow or dirt or maybe even mud that was the catch back in the 60s that was what they were aiming for to promote this transmission as a you know a transmission that could um you know drive the car through the snow or dirt and that was the catch you start in second gear and you get out of uh whatever situation you happen to be in uh, this transmission is great. Um, I really like it. It's it's really fun. You get uh, the best of both worlds, which is uh, you could just cruise in it. But I mean, if you need to to feel the drive of being in control, you could always uh, drop it to low gear, which is first gear, and then move along. If you want to get to second gear, you just pop it up to the green dot. And it'll jump up to second gear if you want to hold second gear you just drop it back down to low and you'll keep uh second gear you'll be able to hold second gear you can hold it for as long as you want i would recommend installing a rpm gauge and uh yeah usually for 200s or v8s maybe 4000 is a uh, uh, V8s, maybe 5,000, 500, 6,000, uh, depending on what you have. But uh, I mean, 200 CIs, 250s, I would go with uh, 3,500 RPMs. And then just, uh, you, you're holding second gear and just pop it back up into the green dot. And you're in third gear. And, you know, that's, that's as far as these go. It's really fun. I'm going to give you a demonstration of what I mean. So let's, let's get this thing running. Low gear. Empty road, so no problem, guys. Low gear. Second gear. Pretty much, uh, can't really do this on my own, but uh, yeah, a little bit of vital issues there. Huh. So, once again, low gear, you hold it, or you could even, if you're just, you could start first gear, green dot. And then if you want to hold first gear, you hold it, you hold it up to 3,500 RPMs. And then you pop it into the green dot. That'll release first gear and put you into second gear. You want to, you rev second gear, you get it up to like 2,500, 3,000, and then you're free to drop it. And that'll hold second gear for as long as you want. From second gear you rev it up to like 3000 and then you pop it into green dot and you're in third gear that'll help you squeeze out some uh, power out of your engine or at least it'll be fun hope you guys found this video useful if i forgot to mention anything on the c4 transmission feel free to drop it below in the comment section i'm not very active here on youtube but you could always reach out to me or follow my journey on instagram my handle is KSO underscore 66. Hope you guys have a good day. Later.